All right, everybody, welcome tonight to the In the Pink team call and also new ambassador training. Um, this ambassador training tonight is for anybody who's brand new, who's looking to get a jump start and just kind of get a feel for you know, how to do this business and how to get involved with the team. It's certainly for sponsors, anybody that's been doing the business for a while, so you guys can get on and kind of learn and maybe get some ideas and do your own trainings. Um, and then of course, it's for anybody that needs a refresher, right? Because we can all you we can all hear this stuff over and over again. And I know for even myself, even with basic training, when I hear it, sometimes I hear something new. Um, so it's sort of an always evolving way to learn about how to do our business a little better and different. Um, so I want to quickly, I'm going to introduce myself. I'm over here dinging. People maybe are sending me messages, but um, so I'll introduce myself and I'm going to do for everybody that's on the team call, you know, I generally do messages or announcements at the beginning, but I'm going to do announcements at the end and that way anybody that's new and watching this video can just really get into the meat of this and what they want and what they want to get out of the call first. And then we'll do all of the announcements and all the stuff that our team's doing at the end. Yeah. Good. Okay, <laughs> excuse me. So I'm Dawn Andrews. I'm a really, really quick introduction for those of you guys that don't know me. Um, I have been doing Plexus for a little over three years now. And if you were on this call and you're a part of this team, that means you're somewhere on my team. So we are teammates. It's likely that you might be somebody that I personally sponsor, but you also might be some um, somebody, a level one or a level two, a level three or level four. So if you're on this call, that means you're a part of this team called In The Pink. And then it's likely that you're also a part of another team. And so you might even have another team call that your sponsor does or another team page. But I'm really glad that you're here and I hope that this call tonight will be helpful for you um, so I started this business like I said about three years ago I at the time was a stay-at-home mom I was homeschooling all five of my kiddos I hadn't worked in a decade um, and before that I had worked and done some promotional marketing and stuff for the Virginia pilot newspaper here locally in Norfolk so that was kind of my background but like I said I hadn't worked in ten years when I heard about Plexus it was through Facebook I was just on Facebook one day, saw a random message from a guy that I went to high school with, and he said something like his wife had started a home-based business, and it was very successful, and she had lost 35 pounds, and her, their family was getting super healthy. And all of those things sounded really awesome to me. Um, I thought, oh, a home-based business, I think maybe I could do that. I could work around my kids. I could work around my homeschool schedule. I'd love to lose about 25 pounds, 35 pounds at the time. I had a two-year-old. So I was no longer able to use that sort of baby fat excuse. Um, and I thought, how awesome would it be to be able to contribute to the family? And at the time, my thinking was very small. I thought, wow, if I could contribute to $200 or $500 to our family, that would be great. Because I had not been a contributor to the, fi the family's finances, you know, for like I said, for about 10 years since I started having children. So that's how I, I saw it. It seemed like a great opportunity. It seemed pretty low risk, $34.95. I totally spend that when I take my kids to Chick-fil-A. And I thought, hey, if if it doesn't work, I'm only out 35 bucks, no biggie. So it was really a low risk way, I thought, to kind of um, to try something new and different. Um, it wasn't very long after signing up and starting the products that I started to feel great, started to lose the weight, and then this really cool thing happened. My brain just kind of opened up to the vision of what this business could be. I started to look around at other girls who I thought were so much like me, who were just killing in this business. They were sharing, they were passionate, they were loving the products, they were getting great um, results and they were sharing and they were growing their business and they were doing amazing things and they were you know promoting in this company um, I started to understand that the Plexus compensation plan was second to none um, I started to understand that the company was first class and full of integrity and so I got really 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 excited about the business opportunity that this company offered so the products were great the business opportunity was second to none and it was just a couple months into it as I started and I'm kind of kind of reflect for you guys being brand new I thought you know what I'm just gonna give this my all I'm gonna commit and I'm gonna give it my all and I'm just gonna really go for it and see what I can do with this um, and so it got very exciting it became very a, a very fun thing to do um, kind of roll into it it's um, it wasn't long after I started to lose weight get healthy started my business so I unfortunately was diagnosed with breast cancer so that was a pretty big life bummer um, but the great thing about Plexus was is so much of the, the health products were very very helpful to me as I was going through treatments 
Um, they helped me to regain energy. And the really awesome thing was, is I was still able to build a very successful business while going through a very major life challenge. And I think that's the beauty of this business is that you can really work it around your life. It is residual. It is about the team. It is about team building and what your team is doing. So to me, network marketing is the most brilliant business model out there because you can do that. It's not all about just your efforts, but it's also about your efforts being duplicated by other people. Um, and so Plexus has been an enormous blessing for our family. And so now three and a half years later, I was able to rank to Emeralds, which was my original goal. I'll, I'll share this with you guys real quick. I saw a quote one time when I was getting started that said, 82% of women who make $100,000 a year or more do it for, with a home-based business. And I saw that number and I just really latched onto that. And I thought, yeah, you know what? I'm going to make that my goal. I love goals. And I thought I'm going to make that 80, I'm going to be a part of that 82% and I'm going to go for it. Um, and I knew with Plexus and the compensation plan and the way that our company is structured, that it was absolutely possible and it was possible in a short amount of time. And so I was able to achieve that within two years of being with this company. Um, and so it's just been a wonderful, wonderful blessing, a wonderful, a really great life hack. It's been in every single way. And so I just wanted to share that with you as you're getting started and as you're looking at this thing. And, and I know when you first start, you know, are signing up and getting started, you're thinking, you know, what is this? And, but I want to encourage you to open up your mind, um, be willing to, 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 to commit, be willing to invest a little bit of yourself and your time into learning more about this incredible opportunity. And most of all, don't be afraid to dream big because you absolutely can dream big um, in this in this business and really the sky's the limit. And I think that's the, my, the most exciting thing for me that there's really no ceiling on what you can do in this business. Um, and so I'm really excited to say that now three and a half years later, I have an amazing team of, I can see some of the, the beautiful faces, Lisa and Kim and Tiffany, you guys are staring at me, so I'm gonna wave at you. Um, and so our team of In The Pink has over 1600 people now and um, spread out all over Virginia, Maryland, got a great team blue blossoming in Florida but you know of course all over because of social media people are all over but, but a lot of North Carolina and Virginia because that's kind of my home base and some of my my um, my leaders home base so it's a it's been a wonderful journey I've learned a lot about myself I've learned a lot about life in general and it's just been awesome okay so that's that I think I got that the, the story could go on and on and on but I don't want to do that because that's not what we're here for so I want to encourage you guys and tell you how you can be very very successful in this business. Uh, okay, so I just made some notes that I'll refer to. So number one, I'm gonna say is just commit, like just commit to success, okay? Just get your mind wrapped around like what this could be and open, open on yourself up to the possibilities and say, I'm going to do this, okay? Um, Number two, and I, these are sort of, we're gonna, I'm going to get to more nuts and bolts, but these are sort of some big things that I think are super important in the beginning, is really having a strong belief. And um, if you think about belief, and I want you to think about belief in four basic quadrants, if you were to have a quadrant like this in four areas of belief. And I know as you're getting started right now, your belief is probably like, I don't know what I believe in. I don't know what's going on, but I'm going to share this with you because I think having belief in these four areas, when you have unshakable and unstoppable belief in the four areas I'm getting ready to share, really your passion will become contagious and you'll be so unshakable and so confident in what we have that you, the, really the sky's the limit for you. So number one is having really um, unshakable belief in the products. And what does that look like? That looks like being a product of the product, of course, right? Maybe you've been on the products for a while and you've had great success and you've just signed up as an ambassador. Maybe you've just signed up as an ambassador and you're just getting started on the products. And so what I say to that is, be a product of the product, take your products consistently, and that goes back to commitment. So we're gonna talk about commitment in all ways, and, and the first way is really committing to being consistent with your products, right? The products don't work if we don't use them. So setting up a schedule, whatever you need to do to make sure that you're using them consistently, and if you have questions about what to take and when to take it, that's what the team's for. That's what our Facebook page is for. We're constantly asking those kinds of questions. So engage with the other team members and ask them, you know, if you're not sure. Um, remember that everything takes time. And so, you, you know, are we gonna lose 10 pounds in a week? I mean, probably not. 
you could, but that would probably be rare. So you have to really be thinking in terms of, okay, I, 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 if whatever your goals are, whether it's weight goals or maybe it's an autoimmune disease goal or to clear up, maybe it's headaches, maybe it's just to get healthy in general. But remember, whatever's going on took time to get there. And so you want to make sure Plexus is not a quick fix and it's not a magic wand. And we're really happy about that because this is a long-term solution to health, to being healthy. And so you really want to give it time. And so we give a 60 day money back guarantee, but to me that is like bare minimum. And I want you to think in terms of 90 days, 120 days, give it three, four, five, six months. You don't want to give up too soon. Um, it is, it's very possible that your body could go through a detox. And that's okay too, because sometimes if our bodies have been, um, you know, unhealthy for a while, or our guts are kind of messed up, and there's a lot of stuff going on, our bodies have to get rid of all that junk, and it's kind of like peeling an onion. You know, there's different layers, and so you've got to be willing to kind of push through. Sometimes a layer might be hard and tough, and um, but that's not the point to give up. That's the point to push through. So be ready for that and be prepared for that. And I tell you that also because I want you, as you are sharing and having people come on as customers, you want to make sure they know that too. You want to make sure that they're educated too, that, they, that they're committed and that you're committed and that you understand that um, it, 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 it might take a little bit of time. All right, so belief in the products. So I'm going back to my belief quadrant. Number two is belief in the company. And you're just getting started, so I get it. You're like, I don't know much about this company. Well, that's okay, because you can learn about the company by being plugged into our team, um, being plugged in and keeping in touch with your sponsor, definitely going to any corporate events that are offered. Um, we have a big, and I'm gonna, it's part of our announcements, but on May the 6th, corporate's doing this big reveal we don't know what it is. It's this big mystery thing. Um, and so they're doing a live stream. So that would be a really great opportunity to get an idea of how corporate works, who corporate is, because we'll all be watching the live stream together on May the 6th. We certainly have convention coming up. It's not too late to register. That's in Las Vegas. So that's a wonderful way to learn a little bit more about the company. But being engaged in our team and being engaged in the team page too will also help you learn because we'll be, I, you know, I post things as well as your sponsor about the company. So really understanding who Plexus is, where Plexus has been, and where Plexus is going, and being excited about that. And just a few things, you know, Plexus really didn't even hardly get started in 2009, and since then we've had just like thousands of percent growth. Um, one year, I think two years ago, we had 16,000 percent growth, and so we've been featured in Success, Success Magazine. We're a um, a client of Morgan Stanley. We have been there, so we have a lot of accolades and a lot of really exciting things. And so, on knowing those things and learning about those things will help build your belief in the company. Okay, the third part of belief that's super important is going to be um, belief in network marketing. So maybe you've done network marketing before, maybe you had a good experience, maybe you didn't. I can tell you that Plexus is different. Um, one of the missions of our CEO and our, mark, our, our executive staff is to do network marketing the way it should be done, can be done, and rarely is done. Unfortunately, there are network marketing companies out there that have kind of given it a bad rap, but Plexus is doing it differently. Um, and you know, with, like I said, a first class compensation plan is second to none. And so um, understanding our network marketing, but also the business, the profession of network marketing. And, um, you know, that was something when I started, I had no experience and knew absolutely nothing. And so I thought, well, if I'm going to commit to this and I want to be successful in this profession, I need to understand it. And so one of the first things I always recommend you do is read Eric Worre GoPro. It's like basic 101. It's a book that you can get it on audio. You can get it on a book. You can also look up Eric Worre videos. There's a new guy on the scene named Bob Bill. No, help me out, Lisa. I know Bill Heilig. He like put it in the chat. So he's really good. Um, he's your virtual network marketing coach, I think. Um, I should have written that down. I'm just doing this from memory. But he's really good too, watching his videos. Sarah Robbins is another really great professional network marketer. She's a woman and very successful in another company, but has some wonderful live Facebook videos. So I highly encourage you to understand the biz. There he is, Bob Helig. Thank you, your virtual upline. I knew Lisa knew it. Um, so invest in learning a little bit about network marketing and the beauty of this profession and what residual income is because it's amazing. A totally, totally amazing thing. Um, so 
That's funny, Salisa. Um, so, okay, so then the last quadrant of belief is gonna be belief in yourself. And this is a very important one, okay? Belief in yourself to believe that you can do this. If I can do this, you can do this. I'm a stay-at-home mom, a bunch of kids, homeschooling. Now, hardly ever went out of, you know, hardly ever went out because I had too many babies hanging on my legs. And honestly, worked this business from the hours of nine to midnight um, and just kind of made it work. And so I'm, and there's so many examples out there of people who are successful in this company who it's like, if they can do it, you can do it. It really, there's no personality type. There's no certain skill set. We don't come in this, into this with a certain resume. Um, we are all on equal playing fields and we all develop and we learn and we grow, but it's a business for everyone. So really from the very beginning, just believe if, if we can do it, you can do it. All right. And you can be successful in this. And so really believing in yourself. And so a mat and, and, and for my people that are on that are, you know, have been around a while, but thinking of yourself as successful and behaving the way that you, the place that you want to be. So if you think of you're like, okay, my goal is to be a diamond in, in Texas. My goal is to get to where, like thinking that way and, and, and behaving that way, behave your way to success. You're going to hear me say that a lot. So that's part of believing in yourself, believing that you, you, you are that and you are going to behave in that way. And that makes a huge difference in our success. And it makes a huge difference in the way that we behave and the way that we commit and the way that we do things. Okay. Um, so that's my belief talk, the four quadrants of belief. Um, so the next thing is really just plug into our team pages. That's going to be important. The people that I see that get plugged in right away and start really engaging with our team are the people that I see stick around and are successful. Um, so I'm going to just say that's one of the, the top things that you can do. Get to know the people on the team and be engaged in what we're doing. We do these Tuesday team calls for In the Pink every Tuesday at 9 o'clock. You can always put it on your calendar. Um, the, the Zoom link will be posted. The graph will be posted. This is a great place to just show up. So I'm like, just show up. Turn your video off. Turn your mute off. If you don't want to be anybody to see, you don't want to talk, just listen in. Um, it's just a great way to connect. So I, I you know, that um, we have, of course, our team page. So getting engaged in that. We have events that we do, like we're doing the local event here in Virginia Beach with Lisa on May the 6th. So getting to those events. Um, I know tonight they did an opportunity meeting at Why Not Pizza in Virginia Beach to so getting to those events. If you are not local, plan your own. Don't be afraid to plan your own. I will say when I started this business, there was nobody around here doing it. And so I was in a position where I couldn't just, I couldn't go learn and train. So I thought, okay, if I want to be successful and I want to do this thing, I'm going to have to just step out of my comfort zone and plan my own. So don't be afraid to, to plan your own. Um, your sponsor definitely will help. Even if your sponsor is not with you locally, um, and another great thing is, is if you're not local, um, let me know where you are because I know a lot of jewels and stuff all over the country since I've been doing this for a little while and I can kind of plug you in. So if you're in New York, you know, I can plug you up, get you in touch with a diamond in New York and you can kind of tag along to maybe some of her team stuff. So we are really good about one plexus. Everybody works together. It's a team environment across the board, across the country, across the company. So we all really, really do help each other. Um, okay. So. So I've talked a little bit about the next thing on my list. I talked a little bit about when I talked about belief was being a product of the product. Super important. Being consistent. Make sure that you have your convenience order turned on in the back office. If you don't know, understand what that means, make sure you get with your sponsor. When you go to your back office, so that means when you signed up, you um, got your own personal website to be able to share with people to sign up as customers and ambassadors, but you also got access to what's called the back office. Um, I generally will just go to Google and I'll put in Plexus Evo, it comes up. You put in your username and your password, which you decided on when you um, signed up, and it'll take you to what's your back office. That's sort of like the how we do our business. That's for we run all of our reports, and it shows us what our PV is, and it shows us like messages from corporate and all that good stuff. Um, on that page, you're going to see a little convenience order, and it's either going to be green if it's on, or it's going to be red if it's off. If it's red, that means you're not on any kind of product auto ship. Okay, if it's green, that means you are on an auto ship, 
but it doesn't mean necessarily that it's gonna automatically ship. Okay, so I'm gonna let your sponsor um, really explain that to you, but it's really important to have the convenience on, the convenience order on, and then also as you grow your team to make sure that your new people understand the importance of that. Um, and we talked about detox, so again, push through with the products, make sure that you're willing, you know, really long-term committed. Um, okay, so when you did come on board and you signed up in the mail, you should have gotten a wonderful welcome kit. Hold on, I have it over here on the floor. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, so you got this wonderful box in the mail. All right, so if you have, I hope that you opened it and got really excited about the contents. If you haven't had a chance to go through it, that's going to be my first challenge. Get up, get the box, open the box, because there's really, really awesome information. All the stuff that I'm talking about right now is in wonderful detail in the box. Um, you've got these wonderful product cards in there that are going to go through every single product that we have. It gives you talking points, ingredients. This is just a, they're like little flashcards. It's a wonderful way to learn about the products. And we have a great Let's Get Started manual. And it's an easy read. Um, it's great information. Go through it. I highly recommend you go through it. And maybe even set up, if you're local with your sponsor, set up maybe a one-on-one -on -one where you guys meet for lunch or coffee and bring your welcome kit and have your sponsor. You guys can kind of work through it together. Sometimes it's more fun to do it together than just on your own. Okay? Um, all right. The next thing I'm going to talk just kind of briefly about, and this is, again, something that I want you to work with your sponsor on, but really thinking about why you're doing the business. Because um, the why you're doing it is what's going to help you really get through the great times, and it's going to help you get through hard times, and it's going to help keep you focused. Without a really rock solid why you're doing it, it's easy to kind of get distracted and get kind of discouraged and just be like, eh, I don't want to, you know, I got other things to do. Nobody comes into this business with nothing to do. I get it. We're already, you know, we have full-time jobs. We're full-time moms. We've got lots on our plate. You know, we, we volunteer. So we sign up for Plexus and we think, um, okay, I'm going to work this, you know, part-time in the nooks and crannies of my life, right? That's awesome. Um, but it's really easy. Life can very quickly kind of take over. Something, you know, goes awry, a kid gets sick, um, you know, parents, all kinds of stuff happens. I call it the weapons of mass destruction. Is They will happen. And without a, a why, the kind of why you're doing it to go back to, it's easy just to kind of push plexus aside and stop being consistent and stop sharing. And then all of a sudden, you know, all the momentum's gone and bam. Even when you were dreaming really big about all of the wonderful things that were going to happen, um, you just kind of, okay. So we're going to talk about, it's just really important to have that strong why. So from the very beginning, I want you to think about why you're doing it. And I want you to think, um, you know, when I first kind of got started, I was like, ah, I want to make 500 extra dollars a month and be able to travel with and make sure I can go to all my daughter's dance competitions. All right. Well, that was, I mean, you know, that was a pretty good why. That, that kept me pretty motivated and focused for a little while. But I, but then I realized I needed that why I needed to get deep, dig deeper and I needed to dig deeper. And so sometimes we have to, um, you know, it can start out as a, just a kind of a superficial sort of, Oh, I just want to make two fifty. I want to pay for my products. Um, and that's all good, but maybe try to dig a little deeper. Like, you know, I like you might say, well, I want to pay off debt. And then I want you to think about what does your life look like when you paid off debt? Like imagine what your family and what your finances are going to look like and how that's going to feel. And then when you can pay that very, very last credit card payment or pay off that car that's, you know, dragging you down. How are you and your husband going to feel? How's your family going to, what are you, what is that going to be able to do? Um, and maybe that's, Okay, so that's just kind of, that's really important. Um, and so I'm gonna, I'm gonna challenge you to work with your sponsor to, to write it down, not just think about it and just cut, because when we just kind of think about it, it, you know, it goes away. And like I said, the work is a mass attraction, but write it down, own it, know it, and then put it in a spot that's gonna keep you focused, right? Because this business does require, in order to be successful, some self-discipline. It really does. We have to be self-disciplined about working our business because nobody's going to fire you and nobody's going to tell you you have to show up. That's the, that's the gist of it. So um, staying really self-disciplined and self-motivated and having a strong why will help you with that self-motivation. 
Um, okay. So another thing to kind of, that's important, and, and this will be something that you'll work with your sponsor on too, is setting goals, okay? Because goals are important. It's good. That's something that I've learned. I never really thought much about goals and never really set goals before I started Plexus. What I've learned is I love setting goals, and I don't like just setting goals now just for Plexus, but I want to set goals for my kids, and I want to set goals for our family, and like where we want to be, because when you have a roadmap, for where you're going, you can be so much more successful and stay on track, right? You can't, we all need GPS. It's your goals are your GPS for your life, your GPS for your business. Um, and so setting those goals from the very beginning is going to help keep you motivated, focused, and on track. So all goals are going to be different, but there's some that I think are kind of standard. So I'll throw them out as you're just getting started. Um, so set a goal pretty quickly to get three customers, all right? You wanna get three preferred customers, and in a minute I'm gonna tell you what that means, the difference between preferred and retail. So set a goal for three preferred customers, because once you get three preferred customers on auto ship, that's really gonna earn you enough commission and pretty much pay for your personal products. How awesome is that? And then you don't have to, to you know, you'll be making enough money, bam, you got your own products. Um, so three customers, and then also set a goal to get three ambassadors, three people on your team you would really love to be working the business with. Um, business builders, people that you think would be awesome, the kinds of people that you would love to be sitting on the beaches of Maui, because when you get to Emerald, Sapphire, and Diamond, you earn a trip to Hawaii. Who do you want to go to Hawaii with? Who do you want to be drinking pina coladas with on the beach? Those should be your top three people. And you go to them and say, I've got this incredible company, incredible product incredible business opportunity I want you to do it with me and it's that easy it really is it doesn't need to be complicated okay you just tell them you think they're awesome and you think you want them to do it with you all right so get three ambassadors three people on your team and three customers when you get to the three ambassadors that's three um, people just like you that are that are that want to work the business or have or, or, or maybe ha even have the potential to work the business I know not everybody signs up immediately thinking oh I'm gonna build a business they might just want their products for wholesale they might think I just I know a couple people that could use the products that's fine too but when you get your three you get a hundred dollar bonus and you'll be officially ranked to silver so silver is our first goal okay um, Another goal would be to start daily sharing. And most of us like to use social media. I will say that probably 95% of my business has come from sharing on social media. Um, and so I, that is my preferred way to share. It is not the only way and not everybody does it that way. So I'm not going to say that you have to do it that way, but I do think daily, starting to share daily and, not, and, and, and Facebook's a really easy way to do that. In a minute, I'm going to give you some ideas on what that looks like and how you can do it. Um, and then you're going to hear, so as part of, part of goals, you're going to hear sometimes us say 531. All right, now what the heck does 531 mean? It's sort of just a baseline for goals. Um, reaching out to five people a day, following up with three people that have shown interest, and then the one stands for having doing one personal development activity because we're, we're we we have to be teachable, coachable, and learn. And so that might that one might be reading a few pages in your GoPro book. That one might be watching a diamond documentary. It might be watching um, a, a video. You know, whatever. Listening to a tape in your car. So if you kind of daily can think, okay, I'm going to get through my five three one. It's just a really good goal baseline, and you're going to hear you'll hear us talk about that. Pretty, um, pretty often. Um, let's see. So that's your goal setting. Um, all right. So now I want to talk. So I'm going to talk about a little bit. Yeah. So the next thing is with um, starting to share immediately. And I, that's probably one of the biggest things I see kind of hold people back is they start the products, they sign up for the business, and they feel like they have to know everything before they can actually go out and share with others. And that sort of, get, I've got to know everything feeling can cause paralysis. And so I want you to just get rid of that. You do not need to know everything. There's really, really, all you have to know is that you're using the products, you're loving the products, they're doing things for you, when you get engaged with the team, you start to hear what they're doing for others. And then you just simply tell people that you've got something that can really help them. Okay. That, and 
that's really the, all there is to it. And so keeping it really simple, um, and here's, and I'm just going to kind of give you a quick overview of products. You do not need to know every single ingredient in the product. You do not need to be a product expert. It's like anything else. The more, the longer you do this, the more comfortable you get with it. You will get there and you will, but you don't have to have it all together in order to go out and share with others. Okay. People understand. And honestly, if someone asks you a question and you're like, you just say, you know, I'm just getting started. That's a great question, but I've got wonderful, I've got a great team and awesome resources. I'm going to find out the answer. I'm so glad you asked because you know what? Every time someone asks you a hard question, that's an opportunity to learn. I think absolutely. Look at every hard question as an opportunity to learn. Um, so as you're kind of thinking about the products, I, you can think about our products really in three categories. I'm going to kind of give you this quick overview. All right, three categories. We've got products that help with health and wellness. We've got products that help with health, wellness, and weight loss. And then we've got products, a set of products that help with chronic pain. So we're really in three categories. As you're talking to people, you can kind of figure out pretty quick, is it just health and wellness that they need? Do they need weight loss or do they also have pain issues? And then we can kind of look at those, those three lines to figure out what would be the best fit, okay? Um, you can never go wrong with health and wellness and health, wellness, and weight loss. The number one thing you can always recommend you can never go wrong is with the triplex combo. Okay. Triplex combo. There you go. That's all you need to know right now. Somebody wants to lose weight. Somebody wants to get healthy. You can recommend the triplex combo. We can build after that. All right. Um, the triplex combo, of course, is the slim pink drink. It's the pro bio five, and it's also the bio cleanse. The three, those three products together work synergistically and they basically are going to do three things. So these are the other three things you can remember. They're going to help reduce inflammation of the body. That's an easy one. Most people are very, very inflamed and they don't even realize it, the inside of our body. So that's why people get such wonderful results in a wide variety of areas. All right. So we're reducing inflammation. We're targeting gut health. I'm sure you've heard a lot about the importance of really good, proper gut health and healthy microbes in the gut. Um, our probio is first class. I've tried other probiotics and our, they don't even compare. Um, and then the last product is the BioCleanse. Um, and then the BioCleanse helps the probiotic do its job. So the probiotic picks up the trash, the BioCleanse takes the trash out. So it's helping with inflammation, gut health, and then of course leveling blood sugar because that's what the Slim does. The Slim Pink Drink really helps to level that blood sugar. Um, so you've got the Slim, the ProBio, the BioCleanse are all working together to reduce inflammation, gut health, and level blood sugar. And that's really all you got to know. Now, if somebody comes and says they want to lose like 25 pounds, and they want to really get their metabolism rolling and going, then we can look at which of the weight loss products to offer. And there's really only three in that line. And so that's another training. And, I, I, and I'm not going to spend lots and lots of time because I'm trying to get a lot of information in 45 minutes here. Um, but just remember, you can't go wrong with a triplex. Okay. Um, okay. So now somebody says, okay, I'm ready to get involved. And you say, okay, so you've got to decide now whether or not you want to sign them up as a customer or you want to sign them up as an ambassador. All right. So there's basically two different ways that somebody can get involved and start Plexus products. Um, Customer is going to be just that. You always want to make sure that you sign them up and, and advise them to become a preferred customer. They can buy, buy as retail. They will pay more as retail and it's a one-time purchase. It really doesn't make any sense because we offer a 60-day money-back guarantee. And like I said, you want to educate people and say, hey, didn't get unhealthy in 30 days, so let's give it a little more than 30 days to work, right? So you want to at least get them to the 60-day mark. So it just makes sense to sign somebody up as a preferred customer. It'll put them on an auto ship. So every 30 days, their products will ship. Um, and it can be canceled at any time. So nobody is ever locked in. Plexus does not want to make anybody feel locked in or pressured. So you can assure them that they can honestly cancel the day after. It's fine. Um, okay. So that's a preferred customer. Good customers are people that, um, maybe you, you really don't ever see them 
working the business at all. Like they're just the kind of people that you just, they, they have absolutely no interest and probably not going to share and they just want to be a customer and you just kind of want to leave them as a customer. Maybe somebody that's um, like that maybe has more of a skeptical spirit, you know what I mean? That says, I don't really know. I'm not really sure. Then you definitely want to put that person as, in as a customer. Let them try the products again, get them going for 60 or 90 days. And then of course, if they're really happy with the products, you can always turn them into an ambassador, right? If they, you, they, you start having that conversation about them sharing or even getting the wholesale pricing. So that's a good, a good customer. When you have a, when you have customers, I'll just kind of throw this in there. When you hit over $500 in, in volume from your customers, you're going to earn 25% commission. Anything less than 500, you're going to earn 15% commission. Okay. Um, all right. So that's how you sign up a customer. The other way to get someone involved is to sign them up as an ambassador. The things that I look for with when I'm signing up an ambassador are somebody that definitely is really excited to get started. Um, and really I can tell that they, they're, they're in it for the long haul. Like they understand that it's not a quick fix and they're, they're like three, four, five, six months. They're going for it, right? They've got big goals and they're really going to go for it. I like to sign people up as ambassadors if I think they have really great potential to work the business because I would say there's tons and tons of really successful people in this company that never intended to work the business, that they came on for wholesale, they came on, you know, just thinking, I'll just try the products, but they end up loving the products. They're super, you know, the kind of people that, that like to share the things that they love and they have a great network, maybe good influence. Um, and so those are the kinds of people I want to sign up as an ambassador, but I definitely don't want to sign someone up as an ambassador if I think they're not going to stick with it because then that doesn't, that's not going to pay, pay off in the long run. Okay. So I hope if there's any questions about that, um, let me know. And I, I'm not really monitoring the chat. So Lisa, if I'm missing anything, let me know on the chat. Um, let's see. So that was a little bit about deciding which one customer ambassador. Um, okay. Something I need to tell you guys about when you're getting started, if you have just started, there's something called fast start gold that you can earn. If you start and you add 20 ambassadors on your team in the first 30 days, you double all of your bonuses, which is really awesome. And anybody that fast starts gold is skyrocketing to the top because you can really, you really hit the ground running. Okay. And tons and tons of people in our company have hit fast start gold. I've seen people start fast start senior gold. We've even had a fast start Ruby. So it's totally, totally, totally possible to do it. So if you're interested in, if you really want to hit the ground, ground running and really want to kill this business, you can get with me and your sponsor and we can really coach you on how to do fast start gold. Um, okay. Well, I mentioned a little bit about how we get paid. We do get paid 11 ways. The compensation plan, it's is its own 45 minute training. That's not going to happen here, but just remember that it's 11 ways. Um, we get paid every month on the 15th and we also get paid weekly building bonuses when we sign up ambassadors. So, um, we have, and if you can remember this, we have a profit sharing model and I will probably do a compensation plan training again, you know, to kind of really explain what that is, but your sponsor can explain that also. It's unique to Plexus. There's no other network marketing company out there that has a profit sharing plan. And the profit sharing plan is what makes the residual income so insanely generous in our company. So just remember that. Um, okay. And so then the last thing I'm going to say is I put together just real quick. I've been pretty good on my 45 minutes, but then we've got um, announcements. So hang tight. Um, an action plan. So if you're just getting started and you're brand new, I'm going to give you some, just some action steps because the most important thing is taking action, not waiting. Like I said, to kind of figure everything out. Don't need tons of trading. Just make, take little tiny, consistent, little tiny things that you do every day will make a big difference. So the number one thing that you can do when you wake up tomorrow is take a pink drink selfie. It's so super simple, right? Got your pink drink. You take the selfie, you're smiling, you're happy. Our motto is um, live, le live healthy, love life, be plexus. So you, 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 you look healthy and you're loving life and you're being plexus. And then you just simply put a, a, something on Facebook that, to the effect of, 
I'm so I'm loving my pink drink. Um, my friend Tiffany shared it with me, and she's had great success with weight loss and leveling her blood sugar. And share a little bit of Tiffany's story. And I'm so excited to get started. I'd love for somebody to do it with me. And then tag Tiffany, tag me, tag some of the people on our team. It doesn't need to be um, overly thought out, right? Just do it and see what people say. People are going to like it. People are going to comment like, what's the pink train? Tell me more. Lo losing weight, level on blood sugar. You're going to get interaction. And every single person that likes or comments then is somebody that you can reach out to and share more. And then all of a sudden you now have a prospect list. You actually very quickly by sharing on Facebook something as simple as a pink string selfie will have a wonderful prospect list. And that's all you need to get started, really, is people to reach out to to share. All right, so that's number one, take your pink string selfie. Um, number two is what we call making a Frank's list, okay? A Frank's list, and they talk about it here in your, your little manual, but it's just a list basically of people that you know. Think about everybody in the world that you know. Um, and the Frank's is just an acronym that stands for friends, relatives, acquaintances, um, neighbors, kids, friends, spouses, friends. Okay, so that's what Frank stands for. So it's just fun. But make your list and have your list. Write it out. Take a picture of it. Send it to your sponsor. It just kind of helps hold you accountable. Because once you kind of think about all the people in your life um, that you can share plexus with, you have something to work with, right? And remember, remember we talked about the 531 where we can reach out to five people a day? You can just kind of go through your list and start reaching out to people. And we're not selling. It, this is a fun business. And we have health products that help people. People are grateful when you reach out to them and you're sharing something that's going to make them feel better. We're not sharing lips. We're not trying to sell lipstick or candles. Not that I don't love those things, but to me, health products. I mean, hello, how awesome. We have something that makes people feel better. It improves their quality of life. So reaching out to those people on your list is a wonderful thing to do. It's a service to them. And if you think of it that way, you're going to be much more confident and much more bold about doing it. Um, number three is this is, we're going to the action. So you, you want you to write your friends list out, take a picture, send it to your, your sponsor, writing out that why we talked about it, write your why out. You, maybe when you get off this call tonight, maybe your wheels are spinning. You can write that why out, share that with your sponsor too. Let her know, right? Because when she knows what your why is and she can help you, she can motivate you, she can encourage you. And she can also remind you of your why on a day where maybe you're feeling a little discouraged. Um, number four is, this is important, I don't think we do this enough with our newbies, is test your website out, right? So when you signed up, you got a website, and it's www.shopmyplexus.com backslash whatever you called it. And most people do their name, but maybe you did something kind of fun and fancy. Test it out. Make sure it works. Go to it. Send it to your sponsor. Have her go to it and try to place an order, you know, go all the way to the order because you want to make sure your website is set up properly and it's working properly. And you know, when you start getting, when you start working with people, there's not going to be any hangups there. Okay. Super important. Test it out. Um, and then I want you to, the last action step is to commit to one personal development activity a day. Okay. Because those personal development, I've mentioned that, is going to be maybe getting that book that I mentioned. Maybe it's watching videos, um, learning a little bit about the product, maybe you know, going through your product cards. If you'll just commit to maybe, I mean, it doesn't have to be long. It can be five or ten minutes. But learning one thing a day, and the more that you do that, and again, this is about self-discipline, remember? You have to kind of say, okay, I'm going to do one personal development a day and stick to it. And then the more you do it, the more you do it, the more it's a habit and you learn in the process. So five action steps, post a pink drink selfie, make a Frank's list, write out your why, test your website, commit to one personal development activity a day. All right. And that is all I had for my new ambassador training. And I did it almost in 45 minutes, 47. So that was, that was what I thought. Um, so that's very good. So I want to, I'm going to stop recording. Should I stop recording or should I? Mm, I'll keep recording. So that way, if you want to hear the announcements is what's going on in the team, you can. Um, all right. So real quick, we've got some, we got some fun stuff going on on the team. Let me make sure. Let me get to there. We've got, um, 
coming up on May the 6th. We've got the big reveal. I've mentioned that all already, at least so on Cube's house. I think Rachel Glenn might be doing one in Florida. I heard somebody might be doing one in Maryland. So um, that's going to be really awesome. We're live streaming that from corporate. We don't know what the heck corporate's talking about. Like, I seriously no clue what they're talking about and why they have to do this three weeks before convention. So it's a big mystery to all of us. So it's going to be very fun to find out what the big reveal is. Um, we have convention coming up May the 29th or June the 2nd. That's our big annual convention with Plexus. It's going to be at the MGM in Vegas. And they still have just, I think, less than a thousand tickets left. So if you have any inclination at all, get registered, do it, figure it out. Leaders are born at events. If you really want this business and you're serious about taking your business to the next level, um, get to convention, figure out how to do it. The rooms are super cheap. At least when I registered for a room, they were. Um, and so, you know, it's like anything else. You just kind of figure out how to make it work. Um, and then the only other thing before I turn it over to Amy, who's going to present the 30 day detox program was, Oh, I know. Here we go. I got two things. It's the end of the month. So make sure all my old, my old guys that have been doing this for a while, make sure you go through your end of the month checklist. You make sure you get people to hundred dollars PV, check your back office, know your back office, know your people, make sure your auto ships are going through. Sometimes those things get hung up and you have to kind of comb through your back office and make sure you, a lot of times it takes us pushing things through. Okay, don't just leave it up to the system. So know your back office. Make sure you're looking. If anybody in your back office is close to 500 PV, you want to help remind them to get to 500 so they get their 25% commission. Um, and then make sure people are, of course, commission qualified. So end of the month checklist. And I'll post something on the page about different things we can make sure we do. Um, we did hit our next. My contest this month was doing the mystery. Like um, we hit... When we hit 10 ambassadors, I gave away a $25 gift card and did a drawing for that. And Missy Sacken won, so she won the $25 gift card and she earned a free product to give to her new ambassador. So the contest is everybody that adds a new ambassador this month gets put in a drawing. The next mystery unlocked was um, with 25 ambassadors. We hit that yesterday. So we have 25 newbies and so we have a $50 prize and I'm gonna tell you guys this on the team called what it is. It is Kendra Scott. Yay. Okay. So the $50 Kendra Scott prize is a very pretty, can you guys see it? It's an emerald necklace. Yay. I got this when I was down in Tampa with Rachel. So Rachel knew she was with me. We went shopping. Um, okay, so I've got, and I've got, um, and I'm going to bump that post back up, and I will do the drawing and give this away. So the winner of the Kendra Scott necklace will also get to pick a free product to give to their new ambassador. So I'm excited to give that away. And the next stop is 50. So wouldn't it be awesome if we got to 50 new ambassadors in the next few days? Eh, we can do it. Why not? The sky's the limit. Um, Okay, so that's all I had. So I'm going to turn it over to Miss Amy, who's going to tell us about a very exciting challenge that she and Tracy Jacobson have put together, and they've opened it up to our team. So Amy, there you go. All right. Well, um, thanks for all that training. That was like a whirlwind training session. Totally impressive. Um, Anyways, yeah, so excited about this detox, and you guys made it even more exciting by your response. So thank you so much for everybody who's responded that they want to be a part, and Tracy and I are really excited to um, get it going, and we're adding people tonight. Um, some of the people that have sent me money I'm not friends with, so I'll have to go ahead and figure that out. I'm a complete newbie to these groups, so um, bear with us, but we'll get you added most likely tonight, and then you can start adding your people. So you'll have the ability to go ahead and add your own uh, customers and potentials, that type of thing. Um, so let me just give you some of the parameters for the group. Um, we had a great question by Rachel on the, uh, in, the, in the pink thread, and um, we've decided that we're gonna 
limit the group to processed or refined sugars and let everybody else fall wh where they will. <laughs> and we'll use the opportunity to educate people on artificial, artificial sweeteners and um, just making better choices. But we want to kind of cast a wide net so that we can bring in lots of people and then, and then teach them or, and give them the opportunity to learn uh, new health information. Um, so just so you guys know what to expect, we will probably do about two to three posts a day. Some days it may just be two, um, but, but we're going to really work on engaging people and getting comments, that type of thing. So um, two to three posts a day, we will do a giveaway once a week. So we're really focusing more on um, education and motivation and that type of thing. And then the giveaway will be at the end of the week each week. Um, so at the end of the challenge, we will have a big finale and it will be an online event um, and we'll be giving away a 30 day supply of Slim at the very end. Um, to wrap things up. Uh, throughout the challenge, like I said, we'll be giving, it, it'll be a smattering of, of things. It might be recipes, uh, motivational tips, exercise tips, um, you know, just lots of things. But we will also, of course, be sprinkling plexus into it. And, you know, on those days that it's extra hard with the sugar detox, you know, we don't want to rub it anybody's face, but we do want to share there are things to help as well, things that can help you get through this easier. But at the same time, we want to keep comments positive. We want to keep it, um, you know, respectful. We don't want to bombard people who have come on that may not be plexus oriented, but we just want to kind of uh, season it with like salt. You don't want too much, don't want too little, but we definitely want them to be, their interest peaked in the plexus. And um, hopefully, if we can get that right combination of it, um, by the end, they'll be gung-ho for Plexus. So that's the goal anyways. Um, by the end of the month, uh, we, like I said, we'll have the finale. And then we will go ahead and let you follow up with your people. And you want to go ahead and, you know, we'll probably... Uh, coordinate some type of, or you can coordinate individually some type of offer if you want to for your people that have made it all the way through. You can just do what you want at the end um, as far as any specials you want to give your customers or potentials at the end. Um, but that would be up to you to follow up with them. And then, um, you know, main thing we, we really want from you, just like you engaged with the um, idea itself, if you could engage during the uh, challenge, that would just, that'll make it for everybody. I think the more that we're engaged, the more positive we are, and um, being active with the post, interacting, I think it'll be a great, a great environment, and um, we're really looking forward, like I said, to casting a wide net and bringing lots of people in um, for our team, for our team, ultimately, but, um, you know, I just think Gosh, I've come so far in my health journey, you know, when I did something like this years ago, um, and then since then, you know, I started off with Splenda, that was my sweetener of choice, or Equal, whatever it may be, and then now to be where I am now looking back, and um, so I think the benefit of things like this is that you learn a little piece each time you do something like this, and then you grow from it. So, um, and you're also going to be establishing credibility with these, with these, uh, the people that you bring along with you. You're, they're going to see the, uh, the health information that you know, and as you're following up with them, the fact that, um, that you care about them ultimately, so, and care about their goals. So anyways, thank you so much for participating. We will get you added, and um, it's going to be so much fun. Thanks. Thank you, Amy. That's, I'm excited. I'm really excited. This is something we've never done before. It's going to be wonderful. Thanks for spearheading it. Um, okay, guys, I will stop recording now. So I got a, we got a nice long hour of recording. Oh, wait a minute. What do I do?